Hello everyone in this video, let us take a look at one uh, question that was asked on the community about uh, hierarchy within uh, Jira. So today I was looking at this question and uh, this is for some reason uh, a very common question and uh, I find it really uh, strange because uh, when new users are trying to find a way to do something simple like uh, creating hierarchy they are not really sure how to do it in jira and i believe uh, uh, maybe the documentation uh, needs to be a bit more clear about uh, whether this can be done uh, in jira out of the box or maybe it can be done with the help of uh, uh, some additional uh, add-ons. Anyways, let us uh, try to answer this question. So this question is uh, uh, from Neelam and Neelam is asking about uh, does Jira provide hierarchical hi hierarch hierarchical deliverable epic story subtask report? And uh, the question is, uh, let me just try to get rid of the, how do I get rid of, okay. So this question is, uh, uh, hello, Jira team, is there a way to, is there a way Jira provide hierarchical, I don't know why I'm not able to pronounce this name today, hierarchical, hierarchical report as per the below with the deliverable epic story progress. So again, um, I think we have uh, talked about this uh, uh, before. If you're using, let us say, Jira software, you have some way to have this hierarchy in um, your board where you can take a look at uh, of course the epics and all the stories under it and also, also the subtask it uh, may not be like a simple tree like structure but you can visualize uh, in a way uh, what are what all are, what all are, what all stories are part of uh, your epic one and epic two and so on but you're limited by epics and stories only and maybe subtask and for viewing the subtask you need to go to the board the actual uh, active board they are not really visible in the backlog view but if you are talking about hierarchies you have two wonderful options in jira uh, but you need to of course uh, do it using additional apps so the first app is the structure structure is uh, an app that you can install on cloud and on server so this question is uh, not very not really clear about uh, uh, the the type of uh, jira neelam is using uh, the deployment method whether it is server or cloud but the good news is that uh, structure can be used on cloud and server both and the main idea behind structure is uh, visualizing the hierarchies because you can uh, uh, visualize uh, your uh, links in Jira. I mean, even if you're using, uh, let us say, epics, stories, subtask, you have more or less links linking these issues uh, to each other. Of course, subtask is a feature, but uh, stories are linked to epics and epics can be linked to maybe some other issue types and you can use structure to visualize this hierarchy and you can also use structure to track the progress structure can do some aggregation for you so this is this is one add-on that i can rec recommend and uh, if you want to learn how structure works you can uh, search for structure videos on my uh, youtube channel i have made uh, videos on structure talking about how to use it uh, to visualize the the hierarchy of your Jira issues. The second add-on or app that I will talk about is Portfolio. So Portfolio can also do something similar. Of course, Portfolio has uh, uh, has other uh, benefits. You can use Portfolio to visualize the hierarchy, but you would use Portfolio to not just visualize the hierarchy, but you can also do other things like uh, uh, creating uh, uh, a roadmap, a visual roadmap. You can use portfolio for uh, for planning. You can use portfolio for uh, uh, scenarios, 
and in the new version of portfolio you have the option to create a roadmap as well where you have of course these uh, hierarchies that you can use so if you are trying to do something similar if you're trying to uh, do reporting if, if reporting is the only requirement then you can definitely use structure but i recommend that you take a look at both these apps and uh, as i just mentioned i have videos on structure and i also have a video series complete video, video series on portfolio for jira so in case you want to learn how portfolio uh, can be used in your situation i am um, recommending that you watch my videos yes i'm doing some self uh, promotion but i think it will help you so uh, this is all i wanted to uh, share in this video i hope you learned something new today and you found this video useful thank you very much